Governor Hogan announces the beginning of Stage 2 of Maryland's COVID-19 recovery. As with Stage 1, Stage 2 will be implemented with a flexible, community-based approach that empowers individual jurisdictions to make decisions regarding the timing of reopenings. The following personal services establishments may reopen to the general public, effective as of 5 p.m. on June 5, 2020. Tattoo parlors, tanning salons, massage parlors, and establishments that provide aesthetic services or provide nail technician services. Personal services establishments shall require staff to wear face coverings while in areas open to the general public and areas in which interaction with other staff is likely. They shall provide services on an appointment basis only. They shall not allow the number of persons to exceed 50% of the maximum occupancy, and they are encouraged to continue to clean and disinfect the area in which services were performed. For avoidance of doubt, retail establishments shall continue to comply with the face coverings order, which requires all customers over the age of nine to wear a face covering when inside the enclosed area of all retail establishments. The following recreational establishments in Maryland shall remain closed to the general public. Gyms, bowling alleys, bingo halls, amusement parks, roller and ice skating rinks, miniature golf establishments, social and private clubs, and pool halls. Restaurants and bars may continue to serve food and beverages to customers for consumption in outdoor seating areas. For those restaurants and bars unable to have outdoor seating areas, food and beverages must be promptly taken from the premises on a carry-out or drive-through basis. Restaurants, bars, and social clubs that serve food and beverages to customers in outdoor areas shall continue to follow currently established requirements. Maryland state government will also begin returning to more normal operations on Monday, June 8th. The Motor Vehicle Administration and other customer-facing agencies will begin reopening select branches to customers on a limited basis by appointment only. Staff will be required to wear face coverings and will have plexiglass dividers at each station. More information on businesses reopening can be found at open.maryland.gov slash back to business. For accurate and up-to-date information on Queen Anne's County, follow our official social media sites.